Three Court Lane businesses now sit in a pile of fire-ravaged rubble. A strip mall caught fire late last night, and once the flames spread to the attic, well, firefighters couldn't stop it. That strip mall near 4th and Hazel housed Tangles, Hair Salon, a pawn shop, and the Good Samaritan Thrift Store, which funds a rehab program for addicts at Pastor Tim Remington's church. KXY 4's Katie Curry working for you with how the church plans to rebuild, rebuild after devastation strikes once again. Firefighters are still looking to figure out the cause of the fire, but they have found the origin, and that is a start. They believe it started right here behind me in the corner of the thrift store. In the glow of the night, all that could be seen is 30-foot flames dancing along the roof of this Coeur d'Alene strip mall. Man, Standing in shock across the street, people personally affected by the good that's come from this building. Every month, there are people who cannot afford to get into Good Samaritan, and every month, faithfully, the Good Samaritan thrift store pays for those people to get into rehab, people who are hopeless, people the community and most of their families have given up on. Today, the shock turned into heartbreak. You know, everything seems to be ruined, and whether it's water damage, smoke damage, fire damage, it's all gone. We lost the whole roof here. Fire investigators say by the time they were dispatched, flames had already engulfed the building. This building wasn't required to have a sprinkler system or an alarm system. If either one of those systems had been in place, we would have gotten a quicker knockdown. We would have gotten quicker uh, notification that there was a fire in here and gotten crews here earlier. Yesterday, a store filled of items donated by the community. Today, store manager Nancy Cafferty was greeted by broken glass and a smoky aroma. My son went through this program. God through this program saved his life. It has not been an easy six months for the altar church. First, the shooting of Pastor Tim Remington, now this. But just as they proved in the past, they will rebuild. We're not going to be sad about it because I believe that God brings beauty from ashes. Fire investigators will continue working throughout the day. They say it might be a few days before we know what caused this fire. As of now, they are not ruling anything out. Reporting in Coeur d'Alene, Katie Curry, KXLY4 News.